Douglas, number two, Eric left the walls. Yes, sir! Hey! Yeah! Oh, Oh, 
Stand back. Incomplete pass for the Cardinals.
Bubble on the play, recovered by...
Running for the Rebels, Chris Grant. Losing for under three. Get on your 
get them dummies all year long where we work on wrapping. Make sure you got good balance tonight, a good stance, the field might be a little slick. So work on that. Backs, if you're cutting a lot, you may not be able to cut quite as quick or as hard. You may have to slow down and make good cut. You may have to just drop your head and get what you can get. You got to take care of the football. Take care of the football tonight. And this is what we did all year for, right here, guys. Right here. Now the fun begins. Playoff time. In here, let's go. A junior, Adam Fred. Number 14 at fullback, a senior, Aaron Flatten. Number 26 at running back, a senior, Cody Fritz. Number 34 at tight end, the junior Joey LeBron. Number 40 at tight end, the senior Matt Luzzi. Number 55, offensive lineman, a junior Austin Ben Boren. Number 60, offensive lineman, a senior Tyler Anderson. At number 92, offensive lineman, a senior, Dusty LeBron. The Seahawks are coached by Dan Baldwin, assistant coach Les Hildebrand, student assistant Jason Chris, and their junior high coach Ben Kramer. Starting lineup for the Artesian Lecture defense. Defensive end, number 52, Darren Amick. At a tackle, number 55, Daniel Neen. At the other tackle, number 57, Gary Spellbrink. At defensive end, number 65, Paul Ackman. At linebacker, number 20, Justin Enfield. At linebacker, number two, Chris Grassel. At cornerback, number 35, Jason Muller. At cornerback, number 31, Tyler Moore. And number 88 at safety, Marcus Murnoff. The Rebels are coached by Rich Danick, assisted by Brian Daughters and Seth Murnoff. Tonight's officials, Matt Clark, Jim Basler, Merle Beanhoff, and Roger Walter.
Russell on the carry.
welcome by number 40, Matt.
Touchdown.
Fourth and inches. Football on the play, we covered by number nine, Fritz. Tackle by Spellbrink. 